if, if let, let's hypothetically, if teacher A is teaching, say, English 4 at Terrebonne, then teacher B comes in from South Terrebonne, let's say. Who takes priority? Who displaces who? And would the teacher yeah. who's been at Terrebonne have to leave English forward and maybe go to a lesser English? Who gets the priority at that L point? Let me clarify that, and I'm glad you mentioned that, Morton. There is, there is a world of difference between an employee who's been riffed and one who's been reassigned. Okay. An employee who's been riffed has no job anywhere. Correct. Or has a job making less money than they'd had the job the day before. If you have just been reassigned, don't go to that classroom, go to that classroom, you've not been riffed. Been reassigned. You, you've been reassigned. There, okay. And that happens every year. The reason mm -hmm. it gets a little more attention this year is because while that's going on, we're also mm -hmm. preparing a budget and all the riff talk is going on and right. people get it confused. Mm -hmm. Staffing on which teachers are assigned is a process we do every year. And that scenario you just described happens every year. Some teachers get, there's not enough sections of English for one year, the, the year before you had two teachers teaching mm -hmm. complete sections of English for. Next year there's not enough sections. One teacher won't be teaching all English for. They right. still have a job, they're still right. teaching, but it's not the same assignment. That's staffing and job assignments. So you know, who makes that? The principal? The principal. The okay. principal does. Now there's policy that governs most of that. There's policy that governs, for example, and it happens every year at, at practically, I won't say every school, but very commonly, that a teacher gets displaced out of the school. Okay. You know, we had 20 teachers last year. This Next year we're going to have 19. The 20 teacher is usually the, the one, the displaced person, there's a policy, is reassigned to another school. They're plugged in according to the displaced policy. Mm -hmm. That happens every year. Now what's happening now with the, with the, with the staffing that's taking place, people are getting staffing confused with RIF. And I want to reemphasize, right. a person that's been reassigned, mm -hmm. that's not RIF. That's not right. RIF. RIF is when, RIF is much, 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 much more painful than that, in my opinion, yeah. in that you're no longer employed. So outside of RIF, teachers who are worried about their jobs really don't have to worry. No, no. You know, they have a job. The, the, the certified teachers in Terrebonne Parish, we are not projecting RIFing certified teachers. Now, let me qualify that. Like I said, earlier you never say never and you never say all because right. you, I can't say there won't be one because we right. have every year right. if someone who is uh, certified only in a very specific elective course mm -hmm. and no kids elect to take that course right person doesn't have a job yeah nobody know, to teach there, there's there, there's no kids there you right. know so if some someone finds himself in a predicament there's no kids to mm -hmm. teach well, you know, we don't provide a job. We what provide about a certified teacher who teaches a course that they're not certified in? We will have some of that. Okay. We will have some of that. What, what we will be reducing, uh, I anticipate a, a, a pretty significant reduction in Every school system has certified teachers, mm -hmm. non-certified teachers. Non-certified teachers are called TAT. It's an acronym for Temporary Authority to Teach. It's every school system's obligation to try to rid themselves of tats. The title is temporary. They're not right. intended to be permanent right. employees. You, your goal is to have all certified teachers. Right. Now, but we, in, a, in a real world, there's just not enough. And in the real around. world, we have not had enough certified teachers. So we've had, they're all college graduates. Right. Uh, uh, and, 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 but they're not, they're not a certified teacher. Right. Those are the ones that are going to suffer the brunt of the teaching reductions. Mm -hmm. You know, that, that's, that's, some say, well, Philip, that's not really riff. You're supposed to be doing that all along. Well, tell, tell that to somebody that doesn't have a job, you right, know. Right. Um, the, 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 the riff is a last resort. And you, by policy, I must do attrition, reassignment, staffing, most effectively, 
before I even go to attrition. We've been in attrition and we've been in, the, uh, in that mode for over a year. Mm -hmm. I was very, very hopeful. And if we have enough time, you can get to where you need to get with attrition. Right. But when the revenues tumble and decrease as rapidly as they have, mm -hmm. they exceed the rate that you can keep up with. But you're fairly attrition. certain you, th you think you can get the 9.2 million under control with just non-certified no 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 so, no, so no, really no. Let, 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 now in other budget cuts but really all the rumors and i'm trying to get to the rumors circulating around the schools are really unfounded because i'm listening to you from, it's from, not that bad is it no no bad I, enough but it's not it's not extreme it is to me uh, understand it is to me but that, it's not that, endless it's 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 not going to make our school system dysfunctional. No, okay. it won't. It's not going to uh, impede a child's education. No, it won't. But it's going to step on some people's lives. Right. When you got to tell somebody they don't have a job. Yeah. I, it, I guess my point is a thousand teachers right now think they may yeah, lose a job, yeah, when in essence yeah, it may be, no. uh, now you're right, yeah. for the hundred that are going to lose for that those job. That it, it's, for the ones that don't, it's not a big deal. To the ones right. that do, it's an enormous deal. Now, let, 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 me, let me point this out, and I want to be perfectly clear and very candid. We're going to be riffing outside the teacher course significantly. You know, the riff plan has not been devised and has not been brought to the board, but I do want to say there's going to be riffing outside the significant riffing. It's the only way I can come up with, it's actually like $11 million. G give me an example. I'm not like, you mean outside, like in uh, food services or janitorial or... Those areas. Well, let, let me just say this. You have classroom teachers, and we're going to stay away from that. Okay. You know, now, outside of that, everything else is going to be on the table. Because you're going back to everything's about education. That's correct. Everything okay. else is going to be on the table now. And all of these positions are good. They're needed. Well, they wouldn't have been there in the first place. Mm -hmm. But when you don't have the money, you just don't, you just, if we had not been in attrition, if we had not done austerity measures for the last year, mm -hmm. with the declining revenue we faced this year, I don't know that we can pay our bills next month. Mm -hmm. That's a scare. That's that's a that causes panic inside of me when I think that. Mm -hmm. I can't let that happen. I can't even let that get close to happening. 